Many business processes live in spreadsheets, like this tracker for store openings. Moving that data to Salesforce objects gets you security, approvals, reporting, collaboration, mobile, automation, etc. But to get there, you'd have to set up the object and then create all of those fields and then do the mappings to import all of the data. If you've got data in a spreadsheet, Object Creator makes all of that easier. We'll log in to our sandbox and allow the app access to our org. Object Creator can connect to cloud services like Office 365 or Google Docs to get your spreadsheet, or you can just drag and drop one from your computer like this. It shows all the fields with examples and takes a guess at the field type. We can even tell it to make pick lists from the values in a column. You can also override those guesses, where some things that may look like numbers are actually IDs. We can use one of the fields as the record name, and we'll give our object nicer names than the one our spreadsheet had. Peeking in advanced settings, you see a few of the cool services we'll get from our new object. A bunch of things are happening now. The object and fields are being created, but also the page layout, the profile modifications, compact layouts, list views, and of course, the data import. Cloudy the Goat says we're good, so let's see the results. In our recent objects, there's our store. We can click on the store, and all of those fields have been created for us with the appropriate types, including the ones we customized. We can open App Launcher and find our new object. There's a list view based on the 10 fields we checked in Object Creator, and we can click on any of our stores to see the details. Now, with our data in Salesforce, we can control who can see or edit a store, build reports, attach files or photos, or automate our business processes.